Uh, what did you get done on this? Uh, well, kind of quarantine the inside of this for you to paint the uh, innards black uh, sometime in the very near future in the wheel wells. Yep. Uh, basically, keep the overspray down to a minimum, pretty much. Uh, like I said, all, I'm, all I did was just kind of keep her clean possible. But all four of the wheel, uh, wheel wells are ready, and what you see is what you get. Some gotcha. old plastic, some new plastic. Today we're going to be painting Eleanor. We're going to be shooting up under the roof, in her side panels, and in the wheel wells. So we're going to be finishing those areas out, but first we're going to epoxy prime them and everything. And you saw Lee, he uh, did all the tape work up on to make sure no overspray gets anywhere else right now. So we want to get these areas taken care of, done. There's nothing more for us to do there. The rest of the vehicle we're going to verify and final out and make sure everything's real slick. Uh, but that'll be after we do this paint regimen. especially with all the ins and outs and ups and downs, that's normal. But what we're going to do is put epoxy over this, and it's going to lock any metal, and then it's going to lock any primer. So it's going to be pretty good. So it'll seal really well. Um, so right now what I'm going to do is I'm going to chem this down, I'm going to blow it down, and then we're going to go right into epoxy primer. I don't know if I have you in the camera well or not. I have to have it flip. guys I'm gonna let that sit for a little bit and we'll come back and shoot the Imran
Okay, we're using an Emron 3.5 plus polyurethane. Really nice industrial coating. This sucker will hold really well on the wells. And we're going to use a 9T00-A. That'll be our activator. So we're going to do an A parts to one part activator and we're not going to do an accelerator on this. Um, the last time I used accelerator it gave me a very short pot life so we're not going to do that today especially with it's over 90 and I'm at 70 percent humidity right now in the shop. So we're going to do eight part, one part and then go shoot. What we're going to do since we're waiting on the green to kind of like just kick off and everything and the wells we're going to start in the inside. And the reason why we didn't need to green the inside was already greened and done already. So um, what you see now is just a 2K overlay and we just wanted to dust it back with 400 grit. That's what we did. So we're just going to go right ahead and paint inside. do two coats. I'm going to do another full wet on the whole job um, and that way I'll be finished for the night with this one and I'll give a 24-hour recycle for kick off, take the tape off and then start moving on to other areas. Okay, let's get this final one done.
everybody, that's about it for this video. I will get more updates as we go. I've been uh, quite busy here, uh, shooting a lot of parts, processing parts um, for everybody's vehicle. And this little girl behind me here just got her first coat of paint in there in the wheel wells. And next up will be doors. Start doing doors. Um, also, finaling out the interior. Put the final color there. Everyone, thanks so much for checking us out, checking in, subscribing, all the good stuff. We appreciate it. We'll see you very, very soon. Take care. Alrighty, um, this is one of the wheelhouses, the driver rear. Uh, I have to finish final sanding this out. We're going to use 400 on a sponge. everybody in today's video let's try this again too everyone today three everyone today we're going to show you blooper reel okay four today we're going to show you a neat little trick that was transcended to, uh, for us we like it so let's go and do the video